Hello, hello, Zesty Pest here, and welcome to Providence, an indie game by 8 Bit Skyline I found on Game Jolt, and it's about three people whose destinies are intertwined, and we find out how. So let's let's find out. It sounds fun. I got seeds. No. No. Me no leggy. Me no want. <laughs> okay. Go inside. We are inside. Cool. Go outside. Lamp. Let's turn that off. Record player. No. Okay, we don't like the record player. Bird cage! We don't like the bird cage. No record player. Okay, let's go to the bathroom. Okay, that's weird. Oh, wait. There we go. Hello? Hello? Oh, they are gone. What's this? I got a package. And it's probably the record player. Let's put the record in! Hello? Honey, can you open the door? I'm in the kitchen or something. Closet door. What's in the closet? Closet. Cool. Closet door. We have another closet. Okie dokie. Well, let's go downstairs. This is pretty neat. The bed. Oh, that's a... Oh, it's the mom. That's a tall lady. Mother! Not now. Can't you see I'm busy? Wow. Rude. Rude much. Go upstairs. Up arrow. Ah, uh, yes. Good morning, champ. Okay. Are your folks home? We're gonna stay silent. Not the talkative type, huh? Nah, that's fine. Sometimes words just complicate stuff. And there's no need to get complicated. You sound like a mobster. I just need someone to hold on to something for me. Okay. It's nothing big, just something that's dear to me. Okay. Wanna help me with that? Sure! It'll be our little secret. That sounds- no one else needs to know. That sounds weird, but sure! Great! I knew just looking at you that you'd understand. Right. There's nothing suspicious about helping a fellow human out. Or it is when you're- when it, you're creepy like that. It's really nothing important anyway. I bet it is. Just a small box. Okie dokie. Thing is, though, I need to know that no one sees its contents. Okay? This is very important. What is this, Pandora's box? You get me? It's very important. We got ourselves a deal? What do you say, champ? This guy's weird. Sure! <laughs> Here you go, champ. Gimme. Give me the box. Trust me when I say you won't regret this. I bet. Can I move yet? Look me in the eyes when I talk to you. You are weird. Sorry, champ. I've had a long day. Right. Bye-bye now. I have no idea who you are, but bye. So I'm gonna go put this in my closet where no one will see. Should I put it here? Or should I put it here? I'll put it here. Plop! There we go. What? Something? Breck, I'm assuming dinner's ready. Get down here. Rude mom. Yes, yes, ma'am. This poor little kid. <laughs> yes. Did you remember to wash your hands? No. No. 
You won't get any food until you wash your hands. Sure, okie dokie. Alrighty. Where's the hand wash? Where's the bathroom? There's the bathroom. Nope. There we go. I thought it was going to close the door. Ta-da! Hands are washed, Mom! I'm hungry. Give me food. Food, food. Did you remember to wash your hands? Yes. Yes, I did. Bon. Oh, it must be French. Go find a place at the table, honey. Okay. I'll bring food to you. Okay. Horizon Station. I would love to see how all this is connected. Can I move yet? No. Because the train's not here yet. Our, our person. There's our purse. Next person. Guy in a suit. Hello. You look very dapper. Na 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 na. He's walking on his tiptoes. Or the, the balls of his feet, not the tiptoes. He looks very light. Trash can. Alright. <laughs> he just pulled out a gun. Cool. Westbound train heading to the station. Am I gonna shoot someone? I don't know what's going on. <laughs> There's another person. Thought so. Am I shooting them or what? He looks like a nice person. Do I have to shoot him? No. No. Am I... Don't talk to the man. Am I shooting the man? I'm shooting the man. Okay. What are you doing? Why are you pointing that thing at me? Uh, look down the tunnel. Hey, man! You new in Port Horizon or something? I haven't done anything wrong. Surely there are others that deserve this more than me. I have no idea who you are. This town is full of criminals. Okay, I. Alright. Murderers! The mob! Please listen to reason! Ah, uh, stay silent. Let's see what you say. Please. I have a wife and three kids. Oh, that wasn't nice. My old, my youngest is only five months old. Wow. S please. If not for me, then for them. They can't lose their father. Why am I shooting this guy? I feel terrible. I'm begging you, please. I said those backwards. Let him live or kill him. Why would I kill this guy? I have no reason to. I'm gonna let him live. Okay. I bet you that was a bad idea. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm pressing charges. <laughs> I can't. I promise I'll stay under- What? Underground. You won't see me ever again. You're not going to be sorry. Okay. I bet you I will be. Thank you. I don't know who he is, but... Okay. Hey, the... That's the guy. That's, that's we were just about to shoot someone, and I, being nice, oh dear. Man. Man. What's all the way, all the way, all the way over here? Absolutely nothing. So let's go talk to the man. There you are. I heard about the mission. It was a great success, yes? Say, I haven't. I have been dying to know. When did you shoot him? In a front, in front of a full train. Uh, stay silent. <laughs> That's my thing. No, you won't share anything. Not even a little detail. Keeping it secret, huh? That's cool. Look at the house. Quite the place, isn't it? Between you and me, he seems kind of lonely. He said he wasn't in the mood for visitors today. Hardly ever is. Who is this guy? Don't worry, you'll get another chance to meet him. Okay. With your success, I'm sure we'll work toge together again soon. Yeah. <clears throat> Better get used to this cold mountain air. 
Alrighty. And we're back with this guy. Shower time. It is a shower, shower, shower. Knock, knock, knock. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Who are you? Apartment door. Hello, what is the package? Oh, we were just doing this. Record player. Oh, that's the guy. I think. Okay. It is a barn. And the old... Oh, I bet you this is him and then him and then him. I bet you it's the same person. I would not be surprised. What is over here? Nothing. Why did I do the spaces? The spaces made a gray box appear. Hello! Father! Hi, son. I'm a little busy right now. This tree's giving me a real headache. Talk to you later, okay? Okay. Okay, Dad. Tree! What do you say, tree? You're a big tree. You're a very pretty tree, though. Look at that beautiful landscape and the color, and I love it. It's a big tree. Wait, wait, I don't have to go upstairs, so I'm not gonna yet. But I went backwards, that's weird. Backwards is in behind that thing, because I know words. <laughs> What's this way? Absolutely nothing! Okay! Go upstairs, the up arrow! Oh, she's playing the... Mom! Not now! Can't you see I'm playing the piano? Wow, Mom is rude! Oh, it's the guy! Someone's at the door! Be a darling and see who it is. Hi there, little fella. Remember me? Yeah. I knew you would! Say, you don't happen to have a little box that belongs to me, do ya? Our little secret? Probably. Yes. Swell. I knew I could count on you. You and me, we're two of a kind, aren't we? You're, you're still kind of weird. <laughs> you don't suppose you could fetch it for me? Sure. That would make me really happy. You're really weird. And you want to fulfill your part of the deal, right? Sure. <laughs> That's the spirit, champ. Go on, get it. I'll be waiting here for you to come back. Alrighty. It better still be there or I'm gonna look like a fool. Darn tootin' fool. Closet door. There it is. Got the box. I bet you everyone's dead. When I go back down, I don't know why, that's just, I, I expect things like that. They're not! Hi, Mom! You're not dead! Ah, oh, there it is. There you go. Excellent! I knew I could count on you, champ. You're welcome. Guess this makes us partners in crime, huh? No? Not really? So long, kid. Bye, bye You did good. I bet you I just helped out in a robbery or something. I bet you, I bet you. So what do I do now? Mom! Okay, okay. I'll get started on dinner. I'll just heat up some leftovers. Mom, I'm hungry. Mom! Mom! Oh, I missed what that said. Can I do anything else? Upstairs. Door. Wash me hands, I guess. Wow, oh, you're good at the piano, Mom. How's Dad? Dad's good. Is it dinner time already? Okay, I'll be right inside. Say, son, who was that man you were talking with? Do you know him? Nope. Nope. Careful, son. Can't trust anyone these days. Certainly not strangers. Okay. If he comes to see you again, let me know, right? Yeah. Sure. I know I know you'd understand. I saw that just in time to see what that said. Hey! 
door! That's not- that door does not work. What am I doing? Where am I going? Why am I not going into- Walk upstairs! Oh. Men! Is that it? Hey! What's up, guys? Speak of the devil! Here he is! The genius behind the motel massacre! What? Come on, man. Share some details with us. Oh, look at man in the gray suit and the green suit. Look inside the villa. Look at the view. We'll look at the man in the gray suit because he's the one talking. Take a look at this guy. He's cold as ice. Is he some kind of a mute? Nah, he's just not that talkative. You don't deserve my words. I guess he doesn't need to considering how good he is at his job. Oh. Look inside the villa! Sure! Sorry, man. He's not feeling very well today, either. What in the hell is wrong with this guy? I'm sure you'll get a chance to meet him later, though. Right. Anyway, did you blow the prick's brains out at the motel? I hope not. You did, didn't you? Yeah, you did. Well, we're the strong silent type, so stay silent! <laughs> What the hell is wrong with this guy? He's just a pretentious douchebag. Yeah, so are you. I mean, look at what you're wearing. That's, like, awful. Hey, hey, calm down. I'm sure we'll get some juicy details if we dig a little. Sure, go ahead. The motel! Ah, so I'm supposed to kill people here, or what? The hell are you staring at? Nothing! Enter motel. Well, I'm not gonna kill him then kill everyone else in there. What's up, dude? Bartender, can I help you? Look at the liquor. Look at the keys. Look at the keys. I'm afraid we're all out of rooms. Not for me! I know what you're thinking. Do you? You wouldn't just... You wouldn't think it judging by the look of the place. Okay. All the rooms got sold out weeks ago, but only two guests have checked in. Oh, good. Time to beat them up. <laughs> Look at the liquor! In the mood for a drink? Sure! Sorry. We're all out. What? Those are the only bottles we have left. You're bull honking me, and we need them for show. Right. Excuse me, sir. Keys are for registered guests. That's nice. One, two, or three. Let's go to three. The penthouse suite, I'm assuming. <laughs> okay. 3B, 3F. Motel room door. Can't do anything in there. Okay. Let's go to two! Better scope out the place before we apparently shoot everyone. For- I don't know why. <laughs> oh, there's a... Guy? Is that a guy? I think it's a guy. Motel room door. Get lost, pal. Shoot you in the face! This room is off limits. Shoot you in the face! Let's check one. He's just doing that... Shoot, shoot, wave. Shoot, shoot. Shoot, shoot. <laughs> and there's another one that's off limits. Alrighty, well, we're gonna... Get lost, pal. This room is off limits. Two. Fine, then. I'm gonna go to... Well, sorry... Oh, that's not... I meant to do zero. I didn't mean to do one. Oh, did I? Or did I? No, I yes, I, I, I sure. Whatever. I meant. Is this one open? It is. Go outside. Motel phone. Welcome to the motel service line. Press one for reception. Press two for continental breakfast delivered to your room. Press 3 for new towels delivered to your room. 
We're probably going to need those. Press 4 to hear the options again. 3! New towels will be delivered to your room shortly. Small fee will be added to your tab of death. Go outside! Ooh! Fire ladder! Let that one go down. Go inside! I'm probably going to need that. Bathroom! Alrighty. Go, let's go to zero. Maybe. I don't think I need the keys. Why am I going to zero then? I don't want to shoot the guy. Apparently I need to just... I don't know what I'm doing. We'll go to two. Because there's no one on three. Oh, he's not here. Good. I can take the keys all I need. 3A. Awesome. That's where I wanted to go anyways. 3A. Pachoo. Apparently, he was... Ooh. That guy must have delivered towels. And while he delivered towels, it distracted him. So I could get the keys. Hooray! Smart thinking me. Motel room door. Use number two. Stop shaking your head. Use the key. Key. There we go. Motel phone. Don't need that. Go bring this down. I didn't intend for all of this to be so strategic, but it is. Fire ladder. Sweet go inside. Hi. Man. One. Shoot him. Two. What the hell are you doing here? I hope that it... Don't you know who I am? One word from me and everyone you know will be dead. Then why do you have your arms up? Your family, your friends... Even your local fucking postman. Alright. Cock the gun. What are you doing? If you do this, your life as you know it will end. Listen. I'll make you a very rich man. In fact, I'll double whatever they're paying you. I don't even know if they are paying me. I don't know anything. Whoever they are. Me? Yeah. I'm on your boat. I don't know friends know me as a very generous man. You could even come work for me. Uh, you're rude, so I'm gonna shoot you. Was I supposed to do that? Uh, I don't know if I was or not. I'm not sure if I was supposed to do that. <laughs> That's not a good sound. Someone is dead in this one, too. This is... Door! Gotta wash our hands, everybody. That's very important. Oh, no! Our parents! Why are our parents hanging? I will probably put a trigger warning into- Oh! Hey there, champ! What are you doing out of bed at this hour? Look at his gun! Why are you staring at me? Oh, wait, you're not afraid of this little thing, are you? It's nothing to worry about. I'm here to protect you. I've never hurt a kid like you. What? You've been so helpful. What? You saved me a lot of trouble, you know. What? Ah. Uh... Two. Look at my parents. What's up with that? Your parents were ill, you know. They didn't want you to get infected. 
They sent me to protect you. You're bullshitting me and I know that. I'll protect you, you know. You are so freaking weird. I'll protect you. You're still really weird. I promise. Uh... Listen, champ. I said, look at his face. I think it's for the best. It's best for both of us to keep this a secret. Talking just causes problems. You know what I mean. We don't want the world to know about your parents, right? What is wrong with you? About their illness? What is wrong with you? Better to put everything behind us, my nose itches. I know you understand what I'm saying. I have no idea what you're talking about. You're so weird. The pain will go away. You're so weird. You're better off alone anyway. What is wrong with you? I guess this is goodbye, kid. Why did you kill my parents? Have a great life. Off. Without parents. You just turned me into... God damn it. Bruce Wayne. There we go. Hey, what's up? Did it? What am I? Hey, there's a guy there now. Oh, he must have died. He must have died. Did I kill them or what? What did I do? Entrance door. That's a door? I thought that was the door. Okay. I'm not sure if I was supposed to kill that guy. I don't even know what's going on. <laughs> Oh, he's gone now! Of course he is! Viewing binoculars! Oh! That's the guy! What are you doing? Um... Turn off... Who the hell are you? Is that supposed to scare me? I don't know. I've had people threaten me a million times. They're all dead now. I killed them myself. Blew their damn brains out. Wait a minute. I have seen you somewhere. <gasps> Before. But you're different. Wait, aren't you? Aim for his head. I bet you're the one who killed my parents, you jerk! Where have I seen you before? Wait. You've got to be kidding me. You're the kid. The little kid from the farm. Yeah, you are, aren't you? Probably, yeah. What the hell are you doing here? To shoot you because you killed my parents, you dingus dang it. It's been years, decades. I've been biding my time. Is this some kind of a revenge thing? Probably. That's pathetic, champ. Still going to shoot you, probably. Had to be done. Why? Bet you want to know why I spared you. Yeah. First, I don't especially like killing children. Well, thanks. I only do it if I have to. Second, I think I saw something of myself in you. Okay. I guess I still do now. Okay. The tables are turned, aren't they? He's talking a lot. Let him live or kill him. Well, he killed my parents, and I don't know why. Uh, why do I have to make these decisions? I don't know. See, I want more information about the story. Like, you know, why did he kill my parents? How long have I been hunting him? Do I know any more information about him? Do I know that he killed them for, like, just because he's a wacko psychopath or because there was a reason? Should Do I have to kill him? Will I get caught if I kill him? I, wa I want to know all these answers. <laughs> I want to know everything, and I don't know. Uh, what happens if I let him live? Will he kill me? I don't know. I'm confused. <laughs> ah! I don't want I don't want to kill anybody even though he killed my parents although I'm not really very connected to them and they were kind of mean to me. Why am I trying to rationalize killing or not killing someone? What is this? This is awful. What do I do? <laughs> I am leaning very heavily towards letting him live. <sighs> Cuz I don't like killing people and I was him. He had a nice record player and he fed his bird. Who's going to feed his bird now? And I like that guy with the stuff. I am just such a gullible person. I don't like killing people. 
Um, I bet you if I let him live, he's gonna kill me. I bet you, I bet you, I let him live. But bye now. Oh, I'm just leaving. I'm, I'm not doing anything. But bye now. What am I going to do? Going to kill myself or something? But bye now. Was that the wrong thing to do? Yeah, you, you jerk. Moving around. Bathroom door. Close the door. Record player. Don't want that. The bird is gone. Apartment door. Let's explore. I can't. Oh. Oh. The fan. Turn the fan off. Sure. Go outside. Sure. Go inside. Nah. Go inside. Why am I over here? What's going on? What was that? Why did that change? What's... Ah, I knew it! Um... Don't do it or do it. Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it. Do it. Do it. Don't do it. <laughs> oh, okay. He was waiting for me to beg, apparently. That's interesting. So he shot him. Why did he kill the parents, though? Is he just a not-so-crazy person? Was that it? Yes. Snore. SR. Production of 8-Bit Skyline. So, But there's so many things I want to know. Oh, why... Why did that guy kill the parents? What was in the box? I'm assuming it because all pieces are composed for something. I didn't finish reading it. I want to know why he why he killed the parents in the first place and why he let the kid live and what was in that box and why did the kid grow up to try to shoot people? I'm confused. What's going on? Are there other endings? If there are, you should play this game and find out. Let me know because I would love to know. So. If you like this video, leave a like below, subscribe to my channel if you want to see more, and I won't finish the video until we finish watching all of the credits, because it's important to watch the credits. Yay, beta testers! So, um, like I said, I'll have a link to the game in the description below, so you can play it yourselves. Excuse me. And again, it's by 8-Bit Skyline, obviously. For more information about Providence, go to their website, 8bitskyline.com. Yeah! Thank you for playing. No problem. Thank you for making this game. It was pretty interesting. I like it. I like it. Is that it? Okay, that's that's everything. So, like I said, play this play this game for yourselves and let me know if there's um, any other endings. I'd love to know. This was a really interesting game and I like how everything was weaved together. Um, the controls... They weren't really weird, it's just going up different levels was the up and down button. I don't know what I thought it should be otherwise. Um, but overall, I really, really liked it. It was really good and made me think and made me question myself, and that's what's good in the game. So, um, play it for yourselves, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!